Hi friends, you're watching Gate Helpline and in this video we will see question number 30 from Gate 2016 question paper. Friends, please hit the subscribe button and click the bell icon to get all the latest updates from our channel regarding gate exam. Question number 30 is, consider the two cascaded 2 to 1 multiplexers as shown in the figure. The minimal sum of products form of the output X is and the options are A, B, C and D. So friends now we will see what is a 2 is to 1 multiplexer and how it works. So a 2 is to 1 multiplexer consists of two inputs that is D0 and D1. One select input S and one output Y. Depends on the select signals, the output is connected to either of the inputs. Since there are two input signals, only two ways are possible to connect the input to the output. So one select is needed to do this operation. If the select line is low, then the output will be switched to D0. Whereas if the select line is high, then the output will be switched to D1. The figure shows the block diagram of 2 is to 1 multiplexer, which connects two 1 bit inputs to a common destination Y. So we can define this Y as D0 S bar plus D1 S. So friends, as we have discussed the working of a 2 is to 1 multiplexer, now we will try to solve the output of this X, that is the output coming from these two multiplexers. So first of all, we will try to solve this first mux and here the select line is P, that is P can be 0 and 1. So if P is 0, it will select this 0 as input and if P is 1, here 1, then the input will be R. So if P is 0, that means it's P bar. So it will be P bar 0 and P R. So it will be P bar 0 plus P R as the output. So which we can see here, P bar into 0 plus P R is the output. So it will result in PR only. So at this point here for input select input 1 we have input as PR and for select input 0 we have input as R bar for the second mux and the select line here is Q. So friends if Q is 0 that is it is Q bar it will get this as input. So it will be Q bar R bar and for q equals to 1, it will take input from here. So it will be q and the input from here will be pr. And there is an addition between these inputs. So it will be q bar r bar for select line 0 and for q y1 as this is the y1 which is the result here. So we substitute this y1 here as pr because here the output is pr. So when we evaluate this, we will result in Q bar R bar plus P Q R. So friends, as per our discussion, answer to this question is option D. That is Q bar R bar plus P Q R is the answer as the minimal sum of products form of the output X. So friends, thanks for watching our video. Please like, subscribe our channel and share our videos to appreciate our work. If you have any doubt or question, Please comment below and keep watching our channel for videos like this.